Hey, Lightwork family. How are you? I hope that you're doing well. I hope that you're having a blessed day and staying grounded. We're going to tap in to see if there's anything you need to know about love, okay? Most High God, Divine Holy Spirit, we thank you for another day, another opportunity to learn and grow. Please allow me to channel the current energies for the collective. I call upon the Archangels, the Spirit Guides, the Divine Beings of the Highest Bright Light. Please come in now and allow me to channel the current energies for the collective. There could be none of me and all of you. Archangel Michael, please protect our energy. Please close the door on anything that is not of the highest bright light. Please and thank you. I'll show. All right, let's see. We're going to use the Romance Angels to see what comes out. Holy Spirit, what's going on in love for the collective? What's the love message? Okay, we have worth waiting for. Divine timing is in the world. Worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life. Ooh. I like that. Okay, let's get two more. And then we'll get some other love messages. What else, Holy Spirit? We have reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life, okay? We don't know. We, we're going to see about that. <laughs> The energy is uh, actually half and half. I feel like there can be more than one person, one not so good, and the one that's a potential uh, good match for you, but we'll see. It says someone from your past is returning to your life. All right, let's see. What else, Holy Spirit? Let's get a couple more and we'll clarify these. Love yourself first. Okay, so it says your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. Okay, so for someone here, the most high in your guides are wanting you to spend more time in the energy of self-love. Okay. Okay, let's get one more. Holy Spirit, please and thank you. Ooh, we have a wedding somebody's getting married we have this situation involves marriage okay so someone here may be getting married very soon the guys are guiding me to get two more to clarify them all so let's see new love we like that a new person has stirred your romantic feelings okay so that's right above i'm sorry right below reconciliation so I'm seeing the Five of Swords energy competition. And the last card we have is Honeymoon. Enjoy the bliss of holiday together. Okay, so the bottom row we have Wedding, New Love, and Honeymoon. Top row we have Worth Waiting for, Reconciliation, and Love Yourself First. So I feel like there's a couple of different scenarios going on here. I feel like you and someone that you were previously connected with could both be going through some type of spiritual awakening or self-love journey at this time and the most high is saying that the two of you splitting up to work on each other was worth the wait for both of you at the same time i feel like uh someone is realizing that you are worth waiting for and they're wanting to reconcile with you and the divine is urging you to love yourself and not worry about that person and the other scenario is you know new love is coming in for some of you and you may very well be getting married so let's get into it bottom of this deck we have time okay so i feel like divine timing may be at play it says i'm afraid it's too late to take action so that may be what this person that wants to reconcile may be saying at this time let's get into it holy spirit worth waiting for okay we have chemistry and it says i have never felt a passion this intense 
we also have runner i don't want to run anymore okay so again this is right next to reconciliation this person that previously ran from the connection is now wanting to come back because they realize you have a great chemistry and you are worth waiting for okay holy spirit why is reconciliation here reconciliation we have reciprocity i want to have equal give and take okay i'm feeling like in the past with the differences in the hands okay i feel like you guys were not really working together polar opposites okay i feel like this person in your energy or this could be you is realizing that you are worth giving to okay um with gossip on the bottom i feel like there's a lot of other people that had a hand in your relationship either coming together or falling apart i'm afraid of what other people will think is what yeah <laughs> so this person is still in the energy of focusing on what other people think and how they feel okay or this could have been their energy in the past and they're now realizing that that was the problem in the first place love yourself first holy spirit why is love yourself first here love yourself first yep values we have too many differences okay so this could be your energy or theirs you could be saying you just i'm just gonna focus on me we're not compatible okay and i feel like this person is regretting the opportunity that they had with you wedding holy spirit wedding why is wedding here we have unexpected outcome things didn't go the way that i planned okay hmm bottom of the deck confusion with this coming up i feel as though there may have been an intent to get engaged with a person from the past okay and that didn't happen and that was unexpected and confusion on the bottom of the deck with i feel unclear about where we stand okay so maybe this person got cold feet in the past Let's get one more for wedding, Holy Spirit. Because I feel like this is past energy from a past person. One more for wedding. Escape. I left when things got hard. Okay, yeah. This is definitely the past person's energy that's wanting to marry you now. Okay. So, thus far, I feel like <laughs> we're clarifying for the old energies. Okay. Let's get something for new love. New love, Holy Spirit. Why is new love here? Inseparable. Our love is always there despite the distance. Ooh. <laughs> I like it. Okay, so this person, you're going to have a very strong connection with this person. The two of you are going to be inseparable. Bottom of the deck, we have soul tie. This could be a soulmate, a twin flame, or um, a high-level connection that's ordained, okay? It says soul tie. I always feel connected to you, okay? I feel like this is a past life connection. This is very powerful energy coming off of this soul tie card okay honeymoon why is honeymoon here holy spirit honeymoon understanding i see your side of the story okay space on the bottom of the deck i need more time to think okay one more for a honeymoon please holy spirit i feel like you're very comfortable with this person unfinished business we still have things to resolve and discuss 
okay and secrets so i feel like again this last this old person's energy is popping up with unfinished business and understanding i feel as though there is one person that's from the past that is that understands the situation that has regrets about things the way things went okay this person may have had a lot of secrets in the past and they're wanting to resolve things with you okay somebody could be feeling like they're unworthy because of the secrets that they had in the past it says you're a better person than i am okay so there's quite a few different scenarios here but the new love is the one that i feel <laughs> is um the most clarity with inseparable and soul tie and new love yeah i feel like there's a lot of I feel like it's more of a feeling, okay? Like, this is a soul connection, soul tie, okay? Past life experiences. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Okay, let's get a little tarot to see what we need to know. We have two of cups and the strength. I feel like this is clarifying the new love. Holy Spirit, how do you want me to clarify this? This person is going to be a protector of you. Okay. Okay. Are we going for each one, Holy Spirit? Okay. We are. Worth waiting for. Why is worth waiting for? Okay. That's the truth. Okay. Ace of Swords. This person is going to be truthful honest, upfront, upright, okay? Let's see. Ace of Swords. Now, this could, this could be the old person. Let's see. Holy Spirit, is this old or new for the Ace of Swords? Is this old or new energy? Let's see. Uh. <laughs> Eight of Swords. I feel like this is old energy, someone that you were in your head about or them and they were in their head about you. But I feel like this person is now wanting to come clean, wanting to be truthful, wanting to see, uh, to give you the truth about the situation and be true to you. I do feel that way. This person's energy, this person is like going to be a fool for you, I'm feeling. This person really recognizes that they screwed up. Okay, what's this, Holy Spirit? Reconciliation. Reconciliation. <laughs> Didn't we see this? It says, wow, this is like the Six of Pentacles as well. Reciprocity. Six of Pentacles. This is equal give and take on both of these cards. Okay, this person wants to reconcile. It's a confirmation. They want to equal give and take okay bottom of the deck we have the empress this person realizes who you are okay like i can't leave the empress with the sun behind that okay this person could be a king of wands all right holy spirit love yourself first love yourself first love yourself first high priestess with the king of swords this is the energy of you sticking with your spirit guides, okay? This is Archangel Michael protecting you. This is Archangel Michael guiding you. You staying connected. You are a high priestess, whoever I'm picking up on today. Okay, they are in your ear. You also could be a queen of wands. You're very powerful, very beautiful, okay? Let's see, wedding. Wedding, Holy Spirit. Why is wedding here? Somebody's got some choices to make. They just keep showing me the two of swords. The sun, wedding. Oh my gosh. You're going to have a beautiful summer wedding with the sun shining. Oh man. This is beautiful. But with this on the bottom of the deck, I feel like somebody, somebody is going to be heavily burdened because you all have some choices to make. Some of you have several options like three or four of people that are wanting to be with you 
but I'm hearing that only two are even coming close to being eligible to even come and sit with you. <laughs> and I'm not saying that in a bougie way. I'm saying that in the sense that the Most High God is not going to allow these other people near you whatsoever. That is why you see Archangel Michael popping out at the same time as this high priestess. You are very highly protected. So the people that we know don't have your best interest, your guides are not gonna let them anywhere near you. They're definitely gonna be in this energy. But there are there are going to be a couple that are upright and that do have good intention that you're going to have to choose from. Holy Spirit, let's get one more for wedding. I just want to get married. <laughs> Queen of Wands. <laughs> Queen of Wands, you getting married, okay? It could be a King of Wands. We did see King of Wands, too. Okay, Page of Wands. This is giving me announcement energy of proposal will you marry me okay Ooh, collect it king of wands when it to come out okay and look what's behind it okay they're telling me to show you four of swords and the wheel of fortune okay this is the energy of this new person though i feel okay they're saying this is clarifying new love yeah, this is clarifying new love. So this person is saying, give it a rest. This is destined. This is my soul mate, my divine counterpart, my past life love. Y'all can go ahead and go to sleep. <laughs> this new love is about to be a doozy. Okay, let's get one more for new love. Holy Spirit, give us one more for new love. This person is just waiting, <laughs> anticipating, okay? This person, this person's confident. This person knows that this is destiny. It's meant to happen, okay? This person is like, y'all about to be upset. This is what this person is saying. <laughs> Go on head home. Go on head home and think about what you should have did, could have did, would have did. <laughs> <laughs> this person this is funny. I think this person is new love. It's going to have a nice sense of humor. We have justice, but this person is also going to be very business-minded, oriented, fair, okay? Whew. Mm. Okay. <laughs> yep. Four of Wands. Oh, my goodness. Okay, honeymoon. Honeymoon, Holy Spirit. Surprise honeymoon here. Ah, ah, Knight of Cups. Okay, this person is about to propose. And it's gonna tear, it's gonna shake some things up for a lot of people. I think it including you, okay? Because you are used to this type of drama, this ten of swords disgusting type of energy that we've all experienced in press. Okay, you're about to get an offer, Empress. Okay, and this is going to change your world. Okay, we got the world with the Empress. Okay, but like I said, okay, there's a lot of options out here. I said three to four maximum. Now, this is like seven of cups energy. So, there are a lot of people that are going to be sent packing. Let this new person tell it. This new person is like certain that they're going to steal you away okay anything else we should be aware of holy spirit the temperance and the lovers <sighs> the most high is saying you waited patiently with the temperance and now this beautiful lover is coming in it's about to go down and that is the truth. Mm -mm -mm. I just saw King of Pentacles, Page of Wands, <laughs> Two of Swords. I told you, y'all was going to have to make some decisions. Yeah, Five of, of uh, Wands. A lot of people fighting over you. A lot of people ready to get 
down and dirty to fight for you, okay? There's going to be some manipulators. There's going to be some love spells. Stay grounded. Clear your energy because some people, these dark energies are going to try to manipulate something to destroy it. So always know that, okay? Nine of Pentacles. Not for long. Not about to be single for long, whoever you are. <laughs> the emperor is showing up oh my goodness this is amazing anything else holy spirit queen of cups what else queen of swords okay there's some there's some adverse energies out here because I feel like the people that these other people have been connected to, okay, there's a king of cups in the reverse that's going to be very emotionally distraught if they are not selected. Uh, not your problem, but <laughs> just clear your energy. Make sure your guys are going to be, uh, be protecting you so you don't have to worry about anybody trying to do anything to you or your partner. And I don't think you're going to need to worry about your partner. Right? Your partner is something else okay this new person okay Ooh. all right let's get a couple of messages from the angels yep look what i split the deck on archangel michael you are protected thank you archangel michael for surrounding me with your protective light okay and hone your psychic abilities see through illusion okay they're reminding you okay high priestess we saw you coming out as a high, a high priestess. So they're saying, okay, you got to use your gifts to make sure you can see through the illusions because these people are going to try to cloak themselves and appear to be your knight in shining armor, okay? So you really have to stay tapped in. All right, congratulations, Collective. I love you guys so very much. Congratulations. Somebody's about to get married. All right. I love you guys. Until the next one, peace and blessings, love and light. Clear your energy. Ground yourself, okay? Stay ready so you ain't got to get ready out here in these streets. And I will catch y'all next time. I'll shake.